Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. There's nothing much to do in my small town, so I came all the way out here to Phoenix. What's there to do in Phoenix? A giant Swedish furniture store. We never had one in our town, so this is my first time. All my friends say it's magical, kind of like Disneyland, so let's see if that's true. I parked all the way in the back to get the full experience of walking to there. A thank you for visiting sign. This is just like Disneyland. Okay, I checked the website and they said the restaurant was open. So if the restaurant is closed, I'm going to be very upset because that's kind of what I came here for. Boo. This place is so big that the street is on is named after it. Hi. First impressions, entrance is kind of plain and boring. Oh, I read about this online. They have their own playing ground for children and apparently they watch their kids for you. Too bad it's closed. Apparently the restaurant looks like it's open. Let's go eat something first. Oh my God, it's huge. I thought the restaurant was just gonna be a small part of the store, but it's like an entire floor. Oh my God, it's like fine dining. I want that. There's actually a long line to get into the restaurant. One person. One? Yes. One. Okay. Fine, I'll take you right back. Alright, thank you. The chef escorted me to a table with a view. Let's get in line to order the food. Ooh, this looks foreign. That looks good. Hi, can I get Swedish meatballs, please? Very lovely. Even got a receipt, like I bought some furniture. This looks good. But let's try the dry cook lingon first. Basically cranberry juice, but a little bit watered down. Mmm. Meatball. Potato. Veggie tails. More dry kick lingon. I'ma finish this. Give me a sec. Ooh. That was good. Not have enough energy to explore this giant store. Look at this. It's like Tomb Raider or something. It's like a Mario Kart track with shortcuts. Let's start with the second floor. What do I suddenly want a Bluetooth lamp? Ah yes, give your kids seizures. Ah yeah, things are heating up in the bedroom. Fake fruit, disgusting. The best part about Ikea's are the fake electronics. They have a whole library. I want to play seen it. Oh, uh, they're empty. I don't know if I'll buy anything. I did just buy a house, but I don't think I need any more furniture. But who knows? Oh, Ikea be selling homes. No wonder so many overnight challenges are done here. I wonder. <laughs> Glued down. <laughs> No shower. Zero out of ten. Aw, <laughs> oh, yeah. Milady. Huh, I didn't know that. 
Thank you, Ikea, for the free Linus tech tip. Oh my god, is this a Black Mirror episode? Mmm, what delicious cupcakes. Get some work done. <gasps> the Mario Kart shortcut. Typical HP. Look at me, I'm so quirky. Oh my god, is that the new Silicon N1 MacBooks? We eating good tonight. Haven't unlocked this area yet. They named the paper bags and they're selling them. Ooh. They thought of everything. Now, why do I kind of want one? All right, we are now back to the restaurant. So we're done with the second floor. Let's check out the first. The elevators are huge. Why am I excited by that? I'm scared. What are these things used for? I just realized I'm color matching the store. Am I the only one that's too lazy to go to the fridge at the middle of the night to get a drink so I just drink from the bathroom tap sometimes? Uh, I gotta stop touching things, but everything's asking to be touched. Hi, g welcome in. Finally, a section for me. It's actually a pretty good price for $10 for all of that. Of course they sell their own boxes too. I'll be honest, Pixar movies always creep me out. Apple Home Pods. Lighter than I thought. I was gonna make a stupid comment on why would anyone want something like this that blocks out like 95% of the light, but then I saw someone do this. Ah, oh, that looks like a fire hazard. No, that looks like a fire hazard. What is this, a used wad of tissues? Ugh, I don't get it. These candles smell like bad breath and spit. Welcome to the jungle. Can't believe IKEA sells live plants too. And they all probably have dumb names that ignore their perfectly good scientific plant name. Ooh, a delicacy. And it has a weird name. It's bamboo. Let me just do a TikTok here. No, because I'm not a degenerate. And I think that's pretty much it. Whoa, we're in the back room now. I think I'm lost. I was gonna buy furniture, but now I don't wanna since my future child is in danger. Oh my god, I'm not prepared for the best part of all. They have a second restaurant, but more importantly, they have a f***ing mini-mart. Ugh, why didn't I bring a cooler? Could have been enjoying some fresh IKEA meatballs at home. That sells it, I gotta get something from here. So, how's the IKEA experience? Pretty fun. It was pretty fun to walk through the store. I also didn't know that IKEA sold that much stuff. And now a lot of you are probably asking, did you drive all the way down to Phoenix for some mustard? And so with that, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Tastes like sh